The Republican-driven privatization plan for education is to impose significant tax cuts for corporations and the wealthy upper-income earners, then use declining tax revenue to cut funding for state-funded education services. There are valid concerns that such privatization of school districts would significantly threaten the improvement, accountability, continued development, and financial stability of an already underfunded public education system. According to the Institute on Taxation and Economic Policy, since 2010, state funding for textbooks has declined 45 percent, funding for supplies and materials has dropped 55 percent, and funding for technology in schools has fallen 59 percent. According to the study, most voucher tax credits go to families earning more than $200,000 annually.